A fire earlier today is being investigated as possible arson, but firefighters are glad in this frigid weather the fire wasn't worse. Early this morning, firefighters quickly put out the flames at Taylor's Place Apartments on East 12th Street. No one's hurt, but it could have created many challenges for Sioux Falls Fire Rescue. Kettle Lands Brady Mallory shows you how these below zero temperatures can be hard on first responders. It's a pretty easy plan to follow. Layers. Well, it looks like you have some warm gloves. Yeah, we try and have a, a few extra sets on us. Layers. I have a bag with extra hats and socks. And more layers. An extra sweater, an extra coat. <laughs> this is what firefighters and paramedics have to put on to protect themselves during calls in bitterly cold weather. I can't help the next patient if my hands have frostbite because you know, I decided not to wear gloves. That's not all they have to consider when crews are at fires like this one on North Highland Avenue in early January. They have to keep an eye on their equipment and make sure nothing freezes up. In these situations, every second could be life or death. Anytime we're using a, a hose line, anytime we set that down, we need to make sure the nozzles are cracked open so the water keeps moving or we can freeze up a nozzle and an entire hose line and that can be very problematic if all of a sudden we need water again. Egging says it's important to pay attention to your body in these temperatures. All the gear and adrenaline can keep a firefighter warm, but that can be dangerously deceiving later on. It's easy when you're fighting fire to forget how cold it is outside, but after a fire, when there's some standing around time, it can be pretty brutal. Whether it's the adrenaline rush or the physical challenge, there are a lot of layers to being a firefighter. But when you cut through them all, Egg Inc. and Van Dyke say you'll find any struggle is worth it to save lives and protect the community. It's a very rewarding career. Brady Mallory, Kelloland News. And they also say to be careful with space heaters or any other device that you use to keep warm because they can easily lead to fires.